Welcome back to another video. That's you. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys what I got. Um, I went to Smith's and I got everything here on the table and I thought I would do a grocery haul. If this one allows me to. It's almost nap time, huh? I got mushrooms and this like sauce um, and then the noodles for that kind of like a mushroom alfredo type of thing um, I guess I should start with breakfast <laughs> okay so we got our wheat free gluten free oats here I really really like those um, I never I hardly ever buy bacon but uh, I just wanted to get some bacon make Joel a nice breakfast one morning Veda always gets her strawberries and eggs we got two things of eggs here um sometimes i'll have like avocado and we'll do toast and eggs here's the bread that i got this time although i do need to find another source of organic bread because i heard this one got sold out to wonder bread so fyi what happened what happened I just made Veda um, this cheese ravioli, and no, it's not the best thing. I know that. Um, and then I gave her, just gave her one of these organic uh, unsweetened apple sauces. Is that good? And then she's going down for a nap. That is faux show. Sure. Okay, back to the grocery haul. This is the yogurt that I always get. It's just uh, Greek yogurt and it's plain and I like that it has the probiotics and it's a really good source of calcium and um, protein, a lot better protein count than uh, just like regular yogurt. I'm going to try this goat's milk for Veda and see how she does with that. Um, I got some almond milk as well but Veda doesn't really care for that and then I got just some creamer. Um, I got some pancake mix. We'll see how those are. Normally don't get gluten free, but uh, I thought I would try it. These are just some like go-to little things for Veda. Um, for snacks, well, we don't really snack like too much other than like fruit and stuff, but I got these pretzel things and this is so, so, so amazing. You guys gotta try it. Um, let me get that off the table. We got some grapefruits, bell peppers for stir fry. Um, I do the stir fry with um, bison. Um, and then we put them in these wraps and it's really good. I add quite a few things though, like, you know, onion. And I actually add, I add this to the meat or I add this to the meat just depends on what I'm feeling um, I got some quinoa and brown rice we really like these um, here is a mango here's some potatoes here uh, let's see, we got apples I really like the green ones and then I got the honey crisp ones as well I just got some coconut water here uh, let's see Grape tomatoes, uh, some berries, what else? Um, I thought I would cook this. I've never done pork chops, but we'll see how we like that. Um, I can do it like with asparagus or something of that nature. Here's the cheese for like fajitas. Um, I got some carrots. I know canned isn't the best, but you know, when our fresh produce runs out, it's nice to just have these like on hand so that I'm at least, you know, giving Veda everything. Um, some pears, she really likes those. Um, some green beans. Let's see what else. Pears, uh, I got this for chili. Just some honey for like oatmeal and toast. 
Um, this is just like another like go-to uh, thing for Veda. Uh, jelly for peanut butter and jelly. And let's see. Of course, bananas. What else? That's basically it. It doesn't seem like a lot, but really you just gotta uh, throw something together and usually works for us. Time to go night night, huh? <laughs> yeah. So anyways, that's pretty much it for the grocery haul. I'm gonna put her down and I'll see you in a minute. So I got Veda down for a nap, so I thought I would just uh, show you guys my prenatal vitamins. Uh, these ones I get at Whole Foods. Um, we have that here in Vegas. I like these because the you can see that it's folate and not folic acid. I think that's really important um, that you're not getting like synthetic folate because uh, you know how important that is. Okay, so a friend of mine is like dying to see what my hair looks like before I go in and get whatever correction they're gonna plan on. I don't know what they plan on doing. But if you had watched my um, part one video, as I'm sitting there, you can like see how much blonde I previously had. And now it's like, it's pretty much all gone. And so that's what really disappointed me and that's why I had to call and complain. And that's why I'm going back. And hopefully they can like either just detox the toner out or, um, just add more blonde like I just like I went from walking in with color to just walking out like with a haircut I don't understand but this is what it looks like I didn't straighten the top of it um, I'm really not used to this this length like at all but being pregnant I know that it'll grow back super fast so stay tuned and I'll show you guys um, <laughs> what they do tomorrow. I've got a little bit more of it straightened out. Um, but do you guys like agree with me? I mean, this is not what I was really going for. Just need a little bit more blonde and I think we'll be all right. I'm getting really tired. It's like five o'clock and Veda's still sleeping, so. I'm gonna wake her up, although I really wanna lay down, but I know the minute I lay down, she'll wake up. And I don't like her sleeping past five because then she's like up till 10, 11, 12 o'clock with Joel. And that's not happening on my watch. <laughs> so I'm gonna go wake her up and probably make myself a cup of coffee. That'd be my second cup today though. You still waking up? Yeah. Let's show them mommy's awesome antique dresser that she did. I'm gonna get my room cleaned up and show you guys.
Okay, so here's the dresser. Um, if you guys have me on Facebook, then you've probably seen the before, but if not, I can try to insert a picture. Um, so, this is chalk paint. It was uh, real wood, so it was really nice and easy to do. But I just chalk painted it and then distressed the corners and um, just all the places that it would naturally uh, be worn. And so I'm really happy with it. The uh, hardware I took off and used a Rust-Oleum hammered uh, like brown spray paint and uh, those turned out really nice so yeah the top is okay the top my mom did we found out after sanding this that it wasn't real wood and it wasn't gonna stain very well so what she did was bought like a tool and she like first painted it like a brown you can see that brown here and then she bought this tool that like makes these grains and it turned out beautiful um, and then she painted it with the dark so that's that's how that turned out um, and that's just dirty but like otherwise it like looks really nice and I'm super happy with it. I need to get a cord right here. But yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions, let me know. So Joel's almost home. I got the house cleaned up. And we're going to start some dinner. Still not too sure about this mom do, but there's no going back now. Uh, give mommy kisses. <gasps> no! Maybe I'll buy this vehicle. <laughs> Let's do it. What you got? Can you see? Bye. Yeah. Yes. Yes.